Hi everyone! In today's video I am going to show you how to make these quick and easy little cuts. They are perfect for keychains and can be a fun and creative addition to your collection. You can use any size of yarn and a matching crochet hook for this project. You can also use different size of safety eyes depending on your preferences. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more creative tutorials. Now let's get started. We will start with the magic circle and chain one. Around number one, make six single crochet into the magic circle. Close the circle. Round number two, make two single crochet into each stitch and you should have 12 single crochet all together in round number two. So two single crochet into each stitch. Round number three, make one single crochet into the next stitch, then make two single crochet into the next stitch. One single crochet into the next stitch, two single crochet into the next stitch. Remember to place the marker onto the first stitch you made. So one single crochet into the next stitch, two single crochet into the next stitch, continue all around. You should have 18 stitches all together in round number three. Round number four, replace the marker and make one single crochet into the first two stitches. So replace the marker, two, and then make two single crochet into the next stitch. So one single crochet into the next two stitches, two single crochet into the next stitch. Repeat all around. You should have 24 stitches all together in round number four. And now for next six rounds, we will make just one single crochet into each stitch and you should have 24 stitches all together in rounds 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and 10. So one single crochet into each stitch. Remember to replace the marker. Turn your work inside out. So inside is the side with the tail, so it should be inside. Now let's start round number 11. We start the creates over here. We will make one single crochet into first two stitches. One. Replace the marker. Two. And now we make a decrease. Insert your hook into the next stitch but under the front loop only. And then insert your hook into the next stitch under the both loops. So front loop and then both loops. So all together you should have four loops on your hook. Yarn over. Now you should have three loops on your hook. Yarn over, pull through all three loops. Again, one single crochet into the next two stitches, one and two, and make one decrease. So again, insert your hook under the front loop, then insert your hook under the both loops, yarn over, pull through all three loops. Repeat that all around, you should have 18 stitches all together in round number 11. Round number 12, make one single crochet into the next stitch, make one decrease. One single crochet into the next stitch, one decrease. Repeat all around, you should have, have 12 stitches all together in round number 12. Round number 13, 
Now it's time to place the safety eyes. You can place them wherever you want. I place them between th th round number three and four at the distance of uh, three stitches. But sometimes I insert them at the distance of two stitches. It's also a good moment to stuff your cut. Okay, round number 13, we will make five decreases in this round. So make just five decreases. This is your first decrease. Second decrease. Third decrease. Fourth decrease. And the last fifth decrease. Now cut the yarn, leave a bit longer tail, then thread the tail onto the needle. You can add extra stuff if you think there is not enough. Okay, so thread the yarn onto the needle and insert the needle under each stitch, but under the front loop only. So not under the both loops, but under the front loop only. One. Two, three, four, five, six, and seven, and pull to close the hole. Hide the tail, secure, and cut the yarn. The ears. I will start them between rounds number three and four. Place the end of the yarn onto the hook and pull it through the stitch. Now chain one. Make a half double crochet into the same stitch. Make a double crochet into the same stitch. Chain one. Make a double make a double crochet into the next stitch. So here between these two stitches. A double crochet. Make a half double crochet into the same stitch. And make a slip stitch into the same stitch. Then cut your yarn and hide all the tails. Make the second ear exactly the same way. So again, place the tail onto the hook, pull it through the first stitch, chain one, Make a double make a half double crochet and double crochet into the same stitch like this. Then chain one and make a double crochet and half double crochet into the next stitch. Slip stitch into the same stitch and cut the yarn, hide all the tails. The tail. We will use these stitches over here for the tail. We will insert the hook between one of these stitches. So I will start over here. Place the tail of the yarn onto the hook and pull it through. Now chain one and make a single crochet between this stitch and the next stitch. We will form a little circle. Now insert your hook into the next stitch and make a single crochet. You should make five stitches and create a little circle.
and now continue to make one single crochet all around you don't need to mark it with a stitch marker continue until you reach the uh, length you want And when finished, cut your yarn but leave a bit longer tail, thread the tail onto the needle and pull it through all five stitches but through the front loops only. And pull the tail to close the hole. Secure, cut your yarn. And that's the cut is finished. I hope you guys liked the video. If you did, please leave thumbs up. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.